And I just want to thank each one of you that was able to come to the Waltham Children's Business Fair this year. I want to thank the children that participated. Thank you so much, guys, for making this happen. It was not easy, but at least we did it. We did it, and we did it really well. Um, the kids made really beautiful works, and now I, I'm just, I can't tell you how amazed I am at their packaging. I can't wait to unpackage everything right in front of you guys. Um, for the people that supported the kids, thank you. Thank you once again. We had over 180, no, 190 items sold, and every child was able to make something at least um we the highest child the highest amount made was about 210 dollars then we had people that made 150 160 and that was just like through the website and we can't i can't really um express how much joy this brought to the kids so let's just go ahead and share what I got. So I got these from um, seashells by the um, by the Cape Shore. So they're shells on letters. So this is Fiona F. And her work is super neat, guys. You should check it out. Um, when you go back to the website and look at the kids' profiles, there's a part where I put um, kids link so once you click that it will take you to the kids pers uh, personal store and you can continue to support them throughout the years so I got this too for my mom um, then one other item I got was from Moshi Moshi Creations and oh my god her sewing is so neat guys you would not believe this has been made by a child but it's so beautiful it doesn't like it's a small size but I'm just gonna squeeze myself in there I just can't wait to look so good while cooking and maybe I will ask her to make me a bigger one but for now I'm gonna rock this one um, then my other item is from Heavenly Boutique and this is her packaging Meanwhile, these kids are just like so Heavenly Boutique is about 14, 13 and ooh, oh my god, the bath bombs guys smell so good. Yay! This is my first bath bomb. Mom. <laughs> and the so please go to her website and continue to support her and buy from her. We need to make sure that these kids' businesses do not stop at the Waltham Children's Business Fair only. We should um, support them more and show them that their efforts are not going in vain. So this is lip gloss by um, Gloss Boss, and this is her packaging. Yay! Yay! Mom. All right. Yep. Yeah. And she put her business card in here for me. All right. Make sure you click on their links. Go back to Mamai Art Gallery's website 
and click on all these um, kids websites and um, links to their Facebook and Instagram and make sure you continue to buy from them guys yay then I got masks from cutie masks oh my god the kids work is so neat like there's no reason for me not to be safe anymore. The item I got were costas. Oh my goodness, they are beautiful. Smiley faces. Yes. And this was from SRK Escotic Arts. And they were the winners of original, most original business idea then i got slime with beads from slime girl i can't wait to play with slime for the first time like i literally hated it because i thought it would uh, like um mess up my house and all that but she made it so well that it doesn't stick on anything it's so beautiful earbud holders from Treehouse Kids Goods. I can't wait to see this. Oh yeah, this is so beautiful. This was the, like the 3D printing. You guys need these. You should get the earbud holder. Like I said, go to Mamai Art Gallery, click on um the kids websites and check out their work and keep supporting them throughout the year then i got a painting this is like my favorite painting i got a painting from um hands on colors and you should just see the quality and the like they are so neat so so neat guys hands on colors they have a facebook page you should check out more of their paintings and more of their work they have been doing the fair for three years now but every year they just keep getting better and better um is from pixie parlor and it is it's a wallet guys it is a beautiful wallet i just can't wait to drop my coins in there and just show off like i said just go to mamai ad gallery look out for the kids profiles in the waltham children's business fair and follow their links instagram facebook their website follow their links and please buy from them some of them are just going to start um are going to grow these businesses and your support is going to be a plus and a bonus a card from srk these are kids guys and what i love about these items is they are they're authentic they are like you're not gonna find it anywhere else it's just it's just by its own then i got hand and foot balm and this was made by true shine they have a lot of cool oh. items um they have the pillow mist i can't wait to try this one like because it just smells so good even before i spray it and um so true shine um that's my other item is nails honey oh my god the packaging so this is nails honey he put his business card for me and da 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 this is my honey um so neil has been doing the fair too for three years now and oh my goodness the kid is so on point with his business make sure you follow him he's on facebook he has his store on etsy 
just make sure you follow him and buy from him he has the honey in very many different sizes so this is the three ounce yeah and um then those who love to read i have a book by nicole tukahira the newest one is also a light um a bell's life lesson so guys just follow these kids show them that they are on point support them because the truth is it's not when you look at the work the finishing and the quality of everything it's too too good thank all of you once again and i want to thank all our sponsors for this year uh brown consulting group in a pickle restaurant waltham culture council um i want to thank brookline bank um, I want to thank Dag, Waybright. I want to thank um, Robert Logan and Rachel, Carolina, then um, Dennis and Susan, La Rosie, Lindsay. I want to thank you so much for sharing the kids' business fair with everybody you know. We are grateful.